Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we're actually going to talk about skincare. I was just live on Instagram today and a lot of people keep been asking me what's my skincare routine. And I was like, well, mine is swell. Let me just make a video about it and share with you guys what's my currently favorite for my skin and little, th that, little things that I learned a long term. But first, let's take this beautiful makeup off and I'm going to show you step by step what I do before I go to bed. Um, so my makeup is just so cute right now. I did not want to take it off, but we all do it in the day. I usually do two steps to take my makeup off. I start with the makeup removal. I use, I use the oil-free cleanse wipe for Neutrogen. I'm not sure if I love this one. It's an acne for skin, but I got it for Christmas and I've been almost done. Um, it's all right. Um, still like debating if I love or not. I usually just like the one from um, the blue one. The Neutrogen is just a regular blue one, but this one's like pretty good. I've been breaking out um, pretty hard lately. I'm not sure what is it, but I'm going to a phase and I feel like we all go through that phase sometimes. This is the phase I'm talking about. It's just everywhere in my chin, here, here. I don't know why, but it's life. So the only thing I don't like, I forgot a lot that I'm using it, I remember. The only thing actually I don't like is that when I'm doing my eyes, it kind of burns a little bit um, compared to the other ones that I use, but I'm gonna give it a try. I usually give it a try for a few weeks. And if it really doesn't work out, I put it in like a little bag and I give it away because I definitely don't wanna use something on my skin that it's gonna upset my skin. So this one is not that good for taking your makeup because it does burn a little bit. So if you have sensitive skin, don't recommend it probably in your eyes like I just did. So after I'm done with the makeup eyes, I like to go in with the coconut oil and really take it off all my mascara because I feel like, uh, just a regular coconut oil, I feel like the makeup wipes, it doesn't do the job. And I love coconut oil because I'm still nursing my eyelashes at the same time I'm taking it off the mascara. So I really go in, see? with the coconut oil on my eyes and everywhere on my skin. I just love coconut oil so much. Like I loved it. I use it for everything and it's like does really, really well for my skin. And I have combination oily skin and it's like one of my favorite things ever. So I go in with the coconut oil everywhere just to make sure I got everything looking specially on my nose because I do not want to block my pores and see it really takes every single thing. Um, they usually say that when I sleep sometimes makeup and it happens like I wake up in the morning I look like a raccoon. <laughs> I'm like so so mean. Alright so skin is cling uh with the coconut oil it really gets it everywhere and i feel like at the same time it just like cleans your pores one thing that i learned is that oil breaks oil so if you do have oily skin and i used to just stay away for any products that have oil because i feel like i was gonna like just build up oil but i was completely wrong i learned that oil breaks oil and it's good to use once in a while i use it every day i have no problems at all it used to go to use some kind of oil just to break in the oil that's build up on your skin and it'll kind of like unblock your pores because when your pores is clean your, your pores look smaller and everybody want to have tiny little pores i mean everybody want to have no pores but unfortunately that's impossible so might as well leave your pores 
extremely tiny. So first of all, I just want to say, guys, excuse me, but my bathroom lighting, it's not as bright as my beauty room, but um, I want to go there and just wash my face and show you guys the products I use before I go to bed. So come with me. All right, so this is the curtain products I've been using lately. Um, this is some of my serums, but first of all, I obsess with this one. It's a cleanser. It's really good. It's been doing really, really well with my skin. So I wash my face with this after I do, especially during the day, I use this one. It's a toner. It makes your skin glow. It's, you can see it right away. And I've been in love with that. But sometimes, especially at night, I use this toner. The PCA Skin. It's amazing. If you guys know this brand, it's super, like, it's one of my favorite brands ever it's not that expensive but you have to go to a facial or a spot to be able to get it so i use those two toners as the one that i'm currently using it and then i have a serum from ren that's the same brand this serum i use it as a finished serum um, when i'm done with everything and i have a vitamin c i use just few drops of this a couple times a week because it's it can get very sensitive i have a moisturize with the sunblock I have two sunblock i have this one that's 30 and this one that's 40. i am right now using this one as my daily moisturize and as my um, spf it's really good i definitely liked it so those are my products that i've been using lately every day and at night i do as you see i have the same one that one's almost done i do love this product from um laser away it's a night serum and it goes really really well for my skin so they're the same i'm just about to finish the bottom and start the the, the new one and i have this one over here i'm sorry my camera if you got it's the skin um medica it's a bright pigmented serum it works but i don't like using every day because it gets my skin very sensitive and sometimes i can break out with this product so i use it like every other day or sometimes it's just dark spots that i have it on my skin just to light them up a little bit for last but not least i have this one oil treatment that i put just in little bit spots on my acne not all over my face just in some spot and i have it for quite a while as you guys see i got this one prescribed um it's really good for your acne especially if you have deep cysts dip acne like myself this one will save your life and it can be expensive but it'll last up to like a year so i feel like it's definitely worth it so those are my currently skincare products that i've been using and let's do step one i'm sorry my bathroom's not the best lighting ever but the fuck i forgot to say that this one over here i forgot to say that my cleanser it's a two-step thing so i got like a little bit of the cleanser and you're gonna put it straight to your face dry skin and you wrap it all over your face. So after you have a face, that's when you put water. So then it's going to turn form as a milky way. And that's when it's really cleaning your skin. So I got it everywhere. Oh. So a little thing about me, I always use a clean towel and I just, I don't rub my face. I just dab it on it. Oh, I make sure I want to, the water to just penetrate into my skin. So I always, I used to think that I was very bougie of having clean towels every day, but it's actually not bougie at all. And it's very inexpensive. I usually go to Target and I got like a pack that comes with like six, sometimes eight, and it'll last me the whole week. So I use them one side in the morning, the other side at night, put it aside, and then in the week, I'll just wash them with Clorox. And this way, you don't put any bacteria in your face after your skin is clean. Because when your skin is just clean, that's when you really want to have a clean, a clean washcloth. And I used to think that was super bougie, but it's not. It's just like an extra step that I learned to add into my lifestyle. 
and we're back so i don't know if it's completely clean tonight i usually like using this serum like I, this toner like i say and i like to put it everywhere especially where i'm breaking out i like soak in where i'm breaking out and i just tap everywhere because i really want my skin to observe and i take my time so especially where i'm breaking out I let it soak in for a second because I want those acne to be gone. It's like, do we all want that? Like, why, right? I usually, I usually say I'm too old to have acne. <laughs> my skin is too bougie. I spend so much time and money in my skin and she does me like that. If I Probably if I have to treat her like shit. Probably if I treat her bad, she will appreciate me. <laughs> hey. So as an eye cream, I'm using this Derma eye cream. It's really good. I got it at TJ Maxx when I was there just browsing around and I wanted to give it a try. And I have no complaints at all. It really helps with my under eyes line it doesn't your, your eyes observe it really well especially in this side because i tend to sleep in this side so i'm always I always look tired in this side of my skin so after that i obsessed with this and like i say as you guys know it's almost done i have a new bottle it's a night cream it's a night serum but it moisturizes so well so i usually use two pumps all over my face and my neck it's surprisingly good i've been using for about i want to say six months or even more it's one that came out where um i got as a sample to try and then after that i've been just in love it does goes really well with my skin so I bring it down to the neck, always, don't ever forget the neck. I used to be that person who always forget the neck. And as a finished product, I just like spray some real good water everywhere. Mm, just because it smells good and just make me feel like ready to go to bed. So this is it, this is my skincare that I, this is my skincare at night. It's nothing so fancy, nothing uh, extravagant. It just works for my skin. It's just what I've been using lately. And even though sometimes I have those things and it happens, I just learn to just to deal with it. You know, it's not every day. I'm, I know that it's not every day I'm going to have perfect skin. And when I don't, I don't stress about it anymore because if I do stress, I'm going to have more acne. So it's not even worth it. But I'm going to put a little bit of that oil treatment a little bit here and there and then call it a night. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more about skincare products, the skin, my skin routine during the day, please leave it a comment below and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.